Good morning, little saints. It's Tuesday. No, it's not. It's Wednesday. <laughs> I wish it was Tuesday. I got a lot to do this week. I'm kind of stressed. A little stressed, a lot to do. But it's Wednesday. We're going to do it. Going to get things done. Upper Room Devotional Guide this morning was from Isaiah 40, uh, beginning with verse 1, I think 1 through 8. Um, comfort, oh comfort my people. Good text for Advent, good text for Christmas. The devotional was moving about, uh, it moved me uh, emotionally, it, about how um, sometimes people need, need the comfort part during this season of Christmas and Advent more than the joy part. Um, we build these traditions and the traditions outlast the people. Um, that's not what the devotion said, but that was my take on it. And so because uh, people may have died, uh, we're left alone for, lonely and, and in need of comfort. So it made me start thinking about how the traditions outlast the people. For many people, Christmas is a sad time of year for that very reason. So that may apply to you. Certainly, I bet it does several, several of the folks that turn into I Can Has Grace. But it does for sure apply to people around you and you can be the person who brings comfort to others um, so that's your challenge this christmas and advent season to not get so wrapped up in your own traditions as to uh, miss what other people's needs might be that would be the role of a little saint this year i tried to get Comfort, oh comfort my people from Handel's Messiah, but Rhapsody had an update, and I don't know what the password was because Sam manages that. <sighs> Give away control. It's okay. I'll get it fixed later. I hope. So, you guys have a good Wednesday, and um, look for ways to comfort one another. Peace.